Is your cornea thick or thin or is it average and why does it matter? Hi, I'm Dr. Nagori. I'm a board certified ophthalmologist and a glaucoma specialist. And today I wanna to help you understand corneal thickness and why it matters. So first of all, what is the cornea? The cornea is the clear part of your eye that is over the iris, which is the colored part of your eye. It is actually a very, very sensitive part of your eye. So if you actually touch the white part of your eye, you won't experience much pain. But if you happen to touch your cornea by accident, you're gonna feel some discomfort. This is actually why when patients have corneal abrasions, they're incredibly painful because the cornea is much more sensitive than the white part surrounding it. So what is the average corneal thickness? The average corneal thickness in the population is between 540 and 550 micrometers, which is about half a millimeter. So why would someone want to know their corneal thickness? How is it relevant to their health? So corneal thickness matters for a few reasons. Having a thin cornea can be a risk factor for glaucoma. Additionally, if you have thin corneas, when your eye pressure is measured, it is actually higher than the number that we see on the machine. So how much higher actually depends on how thin your cornea is. On the other hand, having a thick cornea means your eye pressure is actually lower than what we measure on the machine. Another reason you may want to know if you have a thick or thin cornea is if you are considering something like laser vision correction. In laser vision correction like LASIK, the cornea needs to be lasered and it's made thinner so that the vision can actually be corrected to the right amount. And if you do not have enough corneal thickness, you may not be the best candidate to have this type of procedure done. Now, there are other factors that come into play with laser vision correction, so it's important to have a full evaluation with a surgeon who does these procedures. Now, if you see an ophthalmologist for an eye exam, the ophthalmologist will typically measure the thickness of your cornea, especially if they are suspicious for something like glaucoma, or they see some other corneal problem that could be associated with either a thick cornea, a thin cornea, or just an irregular cornea. In order to check the thickness of the cornea, a device called a pachymeter is used in the doctor's office. Now, in the vast majority of cases, this measurement is typically only done once in each doctor's office because the corneal thickness doesn't typically change throughout the course of your life unless something is actively going on or you've had surgery. Hope you found this helpful. Please support the channel by subscribing below and I'll see you next time.